start tonight with some breaking news. This is out of Oak Cliff. Uh, news 8's Rebecca Lopez, live at the scene of a very serious crash involving some teenagers. Rebecca. Well, let me just show you what's happening here at the scene. You can see accident investigators out here right now. Again, very terrible accident. Three teenagers in critical condition. Police say speed was in, uh, was a factor in this accident. Again, police say that there were three cars involved, two cars carrying students. Uh, they may have been speeding and trying to get around an 18-wheeler when they hit a curb and then hit the 18-wheeler. Witnesses say uh, who watched it say that they ran to the vehicle, tried to pull the students out, but sources say the students were in very bad shape and in fact they could not feel the pulse on one of the victims on at least one of the victims witnesses believe the 18 wheeler fled the scene and when the 18 wheeler came it hugged it pushing it and when it hugged it pushing it down that 18 wheeler just let it go and that car took off but that 18 wheeler didn't reduce reduce speed he didn't slow down he didn't stop he just kept on going and we have now confirmed that the students were going to Lassiter, and that is an early preparatory school, part of El Centro College. Uh, and they were, in fact, going on their way to a high school graduation rehearsals when this uh, came out. We are being told that the principal is, in fact, at Methodist Hospital. They also have counselors there at Methodist as they are trying to obviously comfort the students involved. Uh, DPD says right now they're not sure this is a criminal investigation, but obviously an accident investigators out here. Just a very uh, sad scene out here. Reporting live, Rebecca Lopez, Channel 8 News.